Good morning, or technically it's 2.34. So good morning, good good morning, or good afternoon, depending on where you're at. So we went to Dollar Tree and bought some patriotic stuff. Um, now normally they probably will do this for like 4th of July, but Memorial Day is like a couple weeks away. So what we got is this awesome flag for the car. Um, with our older cars, we used to have flags like these. Um, we used to have them on both sides. We had we we used to have flag for the cars, um, flag cars, I guess. Um, um, we had like uh, two American flags. Um, I think we also had a, like a Texas Rangers flag on the car before, uh, but that was like back in the day. But anyway, so we got a new one. So hopefully that one won't fly away. Uh, let's see. So over here, I did put some decorations. Um, I think I need to go to um, go through my. Uh, need to go through some of the tubs to see if I can find the Fourth of July July stuff because I have more American flags. Like I need to replace that one up there. There's where my plant is right now. Uh, that one. That one I've owned for several years. Uh, let me see what else. Oh, we got this new thing with Jiggy. I forgot what it's called. Um, but this one's new. Uh, yeah, it's new. It's a wind chimey thing with Jiggy. Uh, another flag because I'm like really obsessed with those and I want them all over my garden. Along with some other flags. And then, to go with our new plants, we got this wind thingy majiggy. So that's new. So I, I, I'm doing a Dollar Tree haul at the same time. So I had to finish, wrap that one up. Uh, so yeah, so there goes one of our flags. I uh, so I do believe I have another flag back here. For some odd reason. <laughs> uh, oh, it's gone. Where did it go? Did I move it? I think I moved it. Oh, well, it used to be hanging up on that faucet thing right there. Um, I don't know where it went because it used to be right there, and then someone put it right there. I used to have about like three or four American flags, about yay high. Uh, uh, but yeah, some little stuff for getting ready for the 4th of July. Um, now, I've been doing some um, downtime on some stuff. Um, I don't know how many, I don't know how long I'm actually going to do Instacart. Um, because uh, right now I'm looking for an actual 9 to 5 job. Uh, because the reason is that is because I'm trying to um, get some of my goals done and for right now Instacart wants me to take me to like Timbuktu basically. Uh, way far from here. Um, um, I mean it will be fine if um, they pay me a lot of money to do that. I mean, they're still trying to convince me to do some Dallas jobs. Um, um, but, um, but, I don't know. So, um, I, I ain't going to Dallas. There's no way I'm going to Dallas. Um, you have to pay me a hundred bucks to do Dallas. I'm not, I'm not going there. Um, so, because it's getting summer, and if you guys live in Texas, you know how the summer is. And uh, I think I think I we've, I think my sister has seen a TikTok person um, who lives in Texas. Uh, basically, goes through the whole seasons of how it is for Texas. Like I think he says like like think it was 
between March to May is pre-summer, and then you got June, July, and maybe a little bit of August, that's actual summer, and then like a fake fall, because it's not really fall, or something like that, I, I'm not really for sure. Um, but it, it's something towards that, but yeah. Um, anyway, so I wanted to figure out how I'm gonna do that this part and try to get um, another job. I've already applied to Fuel City, Quick Trip. Probably want to do Quick Trip again because they're not really hiring near here. I'm also applying applied for Dollar Tree and uh, oh, seven eleven. So Ooh, it's windy. So I guess we shall see. What's that's what's that's going to come of it, or something like that. Um, but till then, I'm going to do Instacart. Um, try and get my goals done. Basically, um, I wanted to buy or build a barn dominium. Um, if you guys don't know what it is, it's these big moose houses. Um, it's kind of built like a barn. Kind of. I'll put a picture somewhere probably after the video or if I can edit into the video, probably in the video, I don't know. Um, but I'll, I'll put a picture up here somewhere of what a barn medium looks like. And, um, oh, it's windy! Huh. There's something in my eye. I'm going to film this in the car, uh, because it's a little bit windy, um, but anyway, what I'm getting at, at a barn dominium, it's like cross between, like, it's basically a barn, um, so you got a barn, it's built like a barn, it's a barn and a house collided, I guess, um, and I guess you can build it any type of way, um, some people have it, like, half of it is a house, and then the other half is like a warehouse or whatever else you want to put it as. So for me, it's going to be half house with probably three or four bedrooms. And then where the warehouse is, is we're going to be, um, it's going to be where my business will be. Um, as you guys may or may not know, I did create another channel, um, kind of, I haven't really announced it then. Yeah, but anyway, um, called Adventure Boulevard. I'm trying to make that if I could get into culinary school or whatever, into like a restaurant or some type of thing. I don't know. Yeah. Um, but that's my little business that I want to try and make. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, um, I can make it. Um, anyway, so there's that. Um, so I want a barn dominium. I'm also trying to get a CDL license, um, so I can do some jobs right now. Like I want to work for FedEx or UPS, and for some of the stuff you like, I want to do like their delivery services, you know, like driving the trucks and stuff. And um, because I don't think I can probably do the warehouse. I tried that with Amazon. I wasn't really good at it. So. I'm thinking probably delivering stuff will probably be good for. I don't know. I mean, I'm kind of good at it for doing Amazon Flex, so. Um, so, I got that. But to drive their trucks, you need a CDL license, so. I'm going to probably do that. And then, yeah, fun stuff. Um, the other day we had this big among us wreck also, um, I'll put one of these pictures, one of the pictures that I took up here, um, in a few, or somewhere around the screen. Uh, but somebody have noticed two things, two things. And if you guys are actually from the DFW scanner group that, um, I'm in, then, um, uh, well, welcome. You finally found my channels. Um, or one channel. Um, 
But here's some stuff to ex that I can explain on some stuff. Okay, so one of the pictures pictures I took, I didn't realize there was a Jim Adler, um, uh, what do you call it, um, a Jim Adler uh, ad on there. So I took like a nice shot with that and the car that was in the middle right here, hence that nice little oil stain. And then somebody was asking about this thing right here. Um, and everybody admired that I had lawn chairs right here and thought, thought one of the emergency departments had lawn chairs available so um, people can use it while being treated for the paramedics or by paramedics. Uh, let's see. But I think they were asking about this thing. So it's hooked up right here. It's tangled like there. And so it's just this big among this wire thing. You can barely see it. Maybe. But this right here, we used to, um, uh, when dogs used to go outside, 